once again, the Emeralds, the Emerald City Kryptonite got the 49ers again. So first off, congratulations to the Seahawks fans. Y'all went out there. Y'all got it. Y'all out physical us. Y'all coached us. And y'all just did it all. Y'all y'all just did it all. You you got it together. I mean, we still got a lot of growing together. So props to you guys. Um, I know some of you guys saw Steve Carver's video. I sent some shots, but I'm going to do it again. Um, uh, some of the old school guys, Pigpen, my boy Dicer, Eric the Hawks fan, um, Hawks Nest, a lot of you Seahawks fans, congratulations to you guys. Um, good job for you guys out there. Y'all dominated in all fashions, and we didn't really have an answer. And by after the third play, when Michael... I think he ran 41 yards uh, for a touchdown on us. I uh, just something, just something told me inside that we were going to be in in trouble, especially when um, the Seahawks' offensive line has been struggling so far this year. And I thought that would be a good area for us to exploit and try to get in Russell Wilson's face, and we didn't do that at all. So. Uh, yeah, um, the offensive side, Blaine Gabbert, I'm not trying to jump off this bandwagon yet, but, uh, I mean, I, I don't get all this dinking and dunking bullshit, and take some shots down the goddamn field. I mean, you ain't got nothing to lose, you know. Take some shots. You got Torrey Smith. Who, who, It's just very fr fucking frustrating when a lot of the times when we, we have third and whatever and we're throwing the ball, that's not beyond the first down marker. And it, it, it just pisses me off. Chip Kelly, now, I don't really have that much negative things to say about him so far, except that, you know, I, I'd like to see him take more chances. I mean, the game was out of hand. We were down. I think, I think we were down twenty-one to three. We ain't got nothing to lose in this fourth down. Why the fuck are you kicking a field goal? I mean, send a message to your team that we're not giving up. You get the fourth down. You 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 energize this team, at least a little bit. But basically, you're to me, you're throwing in the towel. You know, and it's the second half. You're now twenty-one to three. You got a chance to get back in it. You ain't got nothing to lose, so why not fuck go for it? But yeah, I, I, you know, I, I just wish I would have seen Kelly be more aggressive in some of the play callings. We ain't got nothing to lose. Why not? And as for the defensive side, like I said a second ago. Uh, they won the battles in the trenches. Their offensive line did a great job. We couldn't really get to Russell Wilson. And, you know, they killed us in the run game. They killed us in the pass game. Antoine Bethea, I, I like his defense in the run department, but in the passing game, he's suspect to me. Yeah, and I, yeah. <sighs> wow. That, 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 that was horrible. That, that was horrible out there today. Um, and I think the only thing that kept me from not being in a, a worse mood was that I kicked it with some people in the Niner Empire today. You know, you know. shout out to C. McCarver Jr. Thanks for having me at your spot again. Uh, my boy, Hawks Hater TV, a.k.a. JD in Sacktown. Mr. Frisco, my boy, Niner Tone. You know, it was good seeing you guys, you know, hanging out, getting some drinks in. Um, if you saw McCarver's video, you saw we were all liquored up, acting like fools, you know, in, our, in, in his Crow video. You know, but it was all good time. And, you know, like I said, if I would have watched this game by myself, I would have just been like, oh, fuck. But, you know, I was around great people, so the loss sucked. But at least I was around great people to help cheer me up. So, you know, like got to look at the glass half full and just got to try to look at the bright side of things because this is it. What can I do? What can I do? So that's it for me. Uh, again, uh, congratulations to you Seahawks fans. And uh, we'll see you again um, 
Yeah. Last game of the year. You know, we'll, we'll do it again. And, um, you know, I would wish you guys good luck till then, but I, I can't do that. You know, no hard feelings. You know how it is. Um, and Niner Empire, next up, Dallas Cowboys. We got to play much better. We have to be more aggressive on the offensive side of the ball and defensively. We just have to be on the same page. And, I mean, if we keep doing what we've been doing these last two games, we're not going to beat the fucking Cowboys. I mean, that's a very winnable game. That's a very winnable game. We just have to play our game in order for us to deliver. <sighs> so then, when you see me, you see me. Niner Empire, one team, one family, one goal. I'll get with that next time. Late.